The National Socialist Party of America was a Chicago based organization founded in 1970 by Frank Collins shortly after he left the National Socialist White People's Party. The NSWPP had been the American Nazi Party until shortly after the assassination of leader George Lincoln Rockwell in 1967. Colin, a follower of Rockwell, developed differences with his successor Matt Cole. The party's headquarters were in Chicago's Marquette Park, and its main activity in the early 1970s was organizing loud demonstrations against blacks moving into previously all-white neighborhoods. The marches and community reaction led the city of Chicago to ban all demonstrations in Marquette Park unless they paid an insurance fee of $250,000. While challenging the city's actions in the courts, the party decided to redirect its attention to Chicago's suburbs, which had no such restrictions. <laughs> Skokie controversy In 1977 Colin announced the party's intention to march through the largely Jewish community of Skokie, Illinois, where one in six residents was a Holocaust survivor. A legal battle ensued when the village attempted to ban the event, and the party, represented by a Jewish ACLU lawyer in court, won the right to march on First Amendment grounds in National Socialist Party v. Village of Skokie, a lawsuit carried all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court, though it failed to carry through its intention at the last minute, Chicago relented and they marched there instead. The notoriety gained from this incident led to the party being spoofed in the 1980 film The Blues Brothers. See also Skokie film Neo-Nazi groups in the Americas National Socialist Party of America v. Village of Skokie